Garcia has weighed 139. My instructions in the back. Protect yourselves at all times. Listen to my commands. Touch them up. Back to playing up, showing his grit. Like this. Cautious start to the first mistake because whoever does make the mistake is going to pay dear. And when I mean backing up, he's using his angles. He's moving each other's uh, foot. As he headlines a pay per view. For the da uh, Davis said he thought he. As Garcia flashes the jab three times, and of course that lead foot battles. Garcia immediately looking to establish the jab. Moving side to side, not staying on the ropes. And of course against the... And right now it's neutral. It's really neutral. Caught by the guard of Jules Abner. Yeah, really. Last to the table over. Two of the last. And in that fight, even Davis said, I don't want to watch against lefties recently. And of course, Garcia overcame all his guns. On his trademark left hook. Jab lands for Garcia at the end of the round. Ronnie threw seven left. There's a straight right. Davis utilizing lateral movement, letting the lead right hook there pops the jab. If he's coming forward, he can't land it as a counter punch to Davis. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he puts straight back like he's doing what he, he, he fainted. He didn't see anything. He didn't take it. And then he power punches landed in the first three minutes. And it, and it, it turns out. Now, one thing Garcia's Ooh, good at is covering, and, and he's doing that fairly well. Or not. And you're in round two, putting the pressure on. But the one he made him was, and they wanted to fight taller. And there, Davis with the... You don't want to do that. Davis is my time is inside. So that's that's how you do it. There's a left hook there. It's like old time. And he's on, he just ducked underneath that left hook, but got cut. Oh! oh. And that's the one thing they were worried about. Bounces back up quickly. See him camp. Oh, and he hits him again with that left through the guard. Left hook by Garcia. And again, Davis beginning to feel it now with that left. But Javantes Davis came in with that beautiful overhand left. He got knocked down. He was doing good. You want to pressure Davis like and to answer that, uh, Al, it, it's only if Davis throws a lead. That left hook to the body by Garcia. Yeah. A more aggressive set. And Garcia putting the pressure on Davis. Landing the right and left. And Davis right, right now with that jab. Keep him busy. Lazy jab. That's where you want to take it. The These guys are, are jabbed. But Commit or do not. Everywhere oh, online, they, they say that Garcia had to take advantage of. Davis is slow starts. Garcia coming up on the final 30 seconds of the third. Davis, Davis be careful. He was looking at the referee. You got to protect yourself. Yeah. And, and you'll be the jab to be concerned about the counter. Fame to counter. And he's backing himself in the quarter. Fires a round for Javante Davis. Is Mike Tyson. Hey, hey. Fainting by Davis and able to pull the Garcia left hook is not a factor right now. The right hand is lethal for the for the soft. See, Davis continues to win the foot back. I, I agree. I think he may have lost that he was going to knock out. There is that left hook that landed. That one just missed, but Garcia tipped that hook because Gar Davis is starting to knock out of the year, dropping and stopping Leo Santa Cruz for the first time as placing his foot where he wants to. He lets go of let go of his hands. Garcia has not been jabbing as much. Shark jabbed. 12 rounds in this, Again, it's and yet the it's the constant threat of yeah. And if Garcia doesn't, uh, it, you know, if Davis doesn't attack too much, the check hook more as Davis comes in. There's whether to land mark left, and there it is. We've seen Garcia counter puncher Abner. Yes. For a knockout to box. Oh, right hand by Garcia inside at the end of the fourth. Davis getting the left hand in again. Again, to look at it. That's pretty good. The, the biggest pay-per-view event of all time. Again, that man, Floyd Mayweather. The left who can't get there is a check yeah. hook. And one thing he has with really him. And yes, no contract weight of 136 pounds. And of course, if you're Ryan Garcia, you still believe that he's quicker with the jab as well. So that's why high against Luke Campbell. That wasn't the case.
Take the jab yeah. away from Garcia as well. Oh, what Davis is doing. Go with that right hand. And he just did when you were mentioning for Davis. There's a list. Even though you might be losing some rounds. In round one, he could be winning Taller these. guy in Garcia. He was getting hit every time he was pulling back. He was working with Eddie Reynoso at the top. It's Ryan Garcia. And uh, Calvin Ford. Garcia shows up as Davis lands the left, goes to the body. Under a minute left in the first. And Davis responds with us. And the way this fight is being fought. But a lot more. And they asked for that in this corner. From Garcia. And it's a lead right hand. Getting in the corner, but fainting. And he told us that. This. Mega main event. Well, Davis is more, lands normally in the 30 percentile of a body punch to keep him sharp. So far, Yeah, and you know, those right hands Garcia landed were good. Oh, and just missed with that sweeping This an adjustment by yes. Garcia. He knows the left hook isn't getting there. Garcia into a potential counter scenario. So far, things are working out very well for him. Remember, he falls. Oh, there's a right hand that caught him. 45 seconds left. So Davis now moving forward because he wants to pass the midway point of the... Look at those fans from Davis not committing. And Joe Goosen told him after round one, he, got... about, he wants him to punish him, but Davis yeah. said he was going to stop Davis him. Davis saw that because, because that... Oh! I didn't see that. He didn't see that, yeah. He wants to try and take the play away. Davis showing Garcia away, showing him that, he, you know, you're not in the fight. And in, a, in these rounds, we can get to that right hand, and he's doing it. Let's bring in our unofficial a minute left here in the sixth straight left for Davis. Davis not so much. He's got to start letting go. Yeah, you don't want to be good. The difference is which punches are more. Let's keep Davis busy with them. In January against Hector Luis Garcia. Garcia. Leach on there, Garcia. Throws this right hand. Davis keeping his left hand very low, and that right hand got in. Number seven. Letting the referee know we've got a little wardrobe malfunction. And then Garcia came back with the right hands in round six, live at 58 55. Davis. Caught in a position where he's, he's uncomfortable. And this round's a perfect example. You have to decide to stop landing that right hand in this round. Even there, he just missed one. Macedo just up before this fight said, No, no, I'll wait. <laughs> Straight oh, left hand lands for layoff is the shortest Davis has had between fights at the two. moment, and he said, "No, I gotta." Don't he, the ones he's landed have been oh, good. And there's a strike. Right and let's not forget, Davis did say, "I don't want to oh. knock him out. I want to punish." He was one of the few left hooks he's been able to get in. Right oh. hand by Garcia, and now, oh, Garcia forced to take a knee. Promoter Oscar De La Hoya, who was stopped by Bernard Hopkins following a paralyzing body shot with a delayed reaction. Gervonta Tank Davis just stopped.